tomorrow, my friends, is actually a big day if you play Advanced Warfare because the first official season of Ranked Play is going to be kicking off on January the 9th and that will continue all the way through to January the 31st. But why does it matter? It matters because you can get yourself some very, very awesome exclusive armor that's only unlocked through playing Ranked Play and there's lots of different armor variations that you guys can pick up on. So I thought I'd share them with you guys and let you know that tomorrow it's all kicking off. Now, if you guys follow me on Twitter, Facebook, Instagram, anything else, um, or even my second channel, to be honest, I've done a load of stuff talking about my new puppy recently, because she's absolutely adorable, and I love her loads. So we just picked up a new puppy literally yesterday, and I did a vlog with her today, hanging out with her, showing her to you guys. So if you want to check it out, I'll leave it down below in the description, and I'll remind you guys at the end. So if you want a little bit of cuteness in your life right now, then definitely go and watch that video. But getting back on track, as I said, the ranked players is going to be kicking off. If we take a look at this triangle on screen here, we can see how the divisions are going to be divided up. So starting from the bottom, the lowest rank you can get into will be bronze, and then you'll proceed on to silver, gold, platinum, diamond, and master. And within master, there'll be a special tier. I've actually mentioned this before in a previous video because we've seen the special armor that you get for this tier, and it's called Grand Master. Now, the top 100 players in the master division will be put into the Grand Master's sort of category, and they will get the best armor possible that you can unlock in ranked play. So that's pretty much the best 100 players in ranked play in the whole world, which is crazy. But as I said, I've already shown you guys that armor, so let's take a look at the armor you can get in the other ranks. So we take a look at this image here and start off with bronze. We can see that the armor is still pretty cool, a little bit chunky, a little bit plain, I guess. Um, but to be honest, all of these are very, very cool, and it's worth jumping in ranked play just to get at least one of these armor. We can then proceed on to the silver armor. A little bit similar, a little bit more streamlined. Next up, you've got gold, which is definitely the nicest out of the three, as you'd expect. And then they get really cool from this point onwards. You get yourself platinum, which personally, I really, really like. It's sort of stealthy, but still very classy. Next up, you have diamond, which looks very cool as well. You've got a mixture of sort of gold, uh, platinum, all thrown into there. So that's a nice mixture. And then from masters, you have the very, very cool royalty camo-like armor. That looks extremely, extremely nice. But as you guys may have seen already in a previous video, you can also get that Grand Master Armor Collection Edition, which is absolutely epic. And only the top 100 players within ranked play will be able to get access to this. That is how exclusive it's going to be. Now, in terms of the rules and how the ranked players actually works, there's a lot of limitations in terms of maps, weapons, um, perks, all of that stuff. And it's pretty much a, a competitive way to play Advanced Warfare. Literally just a press of the button, you go into rank playlist, and that's how you can play competitive Call of Duty if you're interested in that kind of thing. The best thing I'd recommend is jumping in with three other friends and actually doing it together. That way you probably have the most success and also the most fun. In terms of how you proceed up the different ranks, each time you play a match, you're going to be rewarded between 15 and 25 points. However, when you lose a match, you're going to lose between 10 and 20 points. You'll lose if you back out, leave a game, or if you just get a loss, and of course, you'll win just by winning. So don't back out of games. Not a good idea. It's going to set you back. And once you reach 100 points, you will actually rank up into the next division. Um, so you want to basically win a load of matches, be as successful as possible. Now, you could say, oh, it's going to keep on winning. But once you get into the better ranks and you come against better players uh, that are of a similar standard, you could easily go on a nasty lose streak, which then set you back a load of points. So it's going to be a bit of a balancing act. You need to be on point and on form while playing in the ranked mode to get to the best rank possible and get yourself some awesome armor. So let me know if you guys are going to be jumping into rank play to get yourself some of this awesome armor tomorrow when it kicks off. Hopefully you do. I may give it a go. You know, I think I'm going to give it a go. See what armor I can get. Maybe grab some other YouTube friends because I think it'll be awesome. The rewards are very, very cool. Check out that puppy video that I mentioned today. She's adorable. A little black Labrador called Ella. She's very, very cute. So thank you so much for watching, guys. Hopefully you've enjoyed. Hopefully it's informed you a little bit more about ranked play. And I'll see you guys tomorrow with another video.